Hey YouTube, this is TechFank9 and today I'm going to be showing you how to get boot animation onto your Android device. Lately there has been a, a really big pop in how for people searching how to get boot animation and all that. So I decided that I will make a video on how to get boot animation for your device. So let's get started. Before we open up this program which I will have in the description of this video, you want to make a folder named data and inside of that folder you want to make a, uh, another folder named part 1 and inside of part 1 you want to have all the pictures that you want to make a boot animation alright and let's say you want to make it from a video so you want to edit that video to to get the part that you want on there and then use Adobe After Effects I don't know any other program but there are probably are other programs that are cheaper and maybe free that make that video into images like I did here this may be um, familiar for you guys because this is the intro video I have on every single video of my YouTube videos and the one you just recently saw. So just close that out just after you done after you made that, and you want to op open up Boot Animation Factory. All right, I don't want to update it. It's okay. Click on Create a New Boot Animation. Choose folder, desktop, and find the folder name Data. Okay. Uh, you can add boot sound if you want to. I'm not going to. It doesn't really matter. And here I'm gonna add a boot, add a loop, and I'm gonna choose part one. All right, that's where the, all your images are. So you wanna add that, and in set number of loops, how many times it will go over and over. All right, and you can delay it or whatever the speed. You wanna add that. You can see it changed. After that. You can repeat it or don't, so I'm going to be repeating it because I don't want it to be still. It's your opinion, this is um very custom for you. And let's preview it. Hold on. Let me adjust this. There you go, you can see the boot animation. Alright, this is my intro video and I made it so all into images. And this is what you will get onto your phone. Alright, you can use your custom size or it will make its own size. I'm just going to leave it alone. You can uh, play with this to get the best fit for you, your phone. So after this, you want to save the boot animation. Alright, I'm going to just name it as boot up. And I'll save it to my desktop. Alright, after you got that done. I get it right here. You're gonna click right here on the little arrow, boot animation, and flash to phone. <coughs> You're gonna click choose boot animation. Um, I did boot up, boot up zip. It will be a zip file. All right. It says it's gonna be saved into system media. Just leave that alone. That's where it's supposed to be saved for the boot animation to be correctly working. You can use this tool to put it in manually, or you can put this tool to put it in automatically, or you can just put it, the file that you saved, this file say that you saved, you can put it in manually, but I just choose to do it automatically. It's a lot easier to flashes and all that by itself, so let's work for me, you know. So after you got that done, you you don't want to you don't have to click on wait for device as long as you just plug it in right now. So um, go find your USB USB connector or whatever the micro micro USB and your phone plug it into the computer and uh, just wait you don't have to turn on the USB connected logo thing you don't have to turn on that USB connected when that thing pops up you can just leave it on just plug it in and don't even touch your phone after that and you want to do click reboot after flash that's what I do and you want to do SU permission all right and you just want to click flash the phone And it'll only take a few minutes. Alright, we're good. It's pushing it toward it. And, it. and within like a minute or two, it will have your boot animation working. And um, I will be showing you on my camera the boot animation, like how it looks from this, the, as I put the intro video on there. I don't know if it's going to look 
it hasn't looked perfect the last times I tried it. I just have to um, fix it, make the resolution better and all that, but it's just trial and error. So you just keep trying, or you can just Google up boot animations and you can get a really cool one if you don't really care which one it is, or you can make your own. I really, I like making my own because it's more unique, you know, it's better. Alright, it's rebooting my phone right now. And when it's done rebooting, I will make a camera. So I'll be back when it's done rebooting with my camera. Alright, just finished rebooting, so I'm going to be turning it on. And let me reboot it so you can see the boot animation. Reboot, yep. And let's see it. And um, I, <coughs> I looked at it before I came, just make sure it applied. And um, it is not perfect, but it it will show you how to get it. And um, I will use this tool every time. I just have to make the images more accurate and the right size. All right, and right after this, you will see it. And there you go. You can see right there. That's my video. I could add audio if I wanted to, but I just chose not to to make the f uh, video faster. But you can if you want. And there you go. Right. And there it is. See? It's a quick boot up. Um, it's just something that you can make on your own, you know? It's just neat that you can make it on your own, you know? It's cool. You can just show it off to your friends and all that. So, um, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe, guys. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Hopefully, I helped you with this video.